Rebirth of Glory mini expansion, right? <gasps> I don't like Rebirth of Glory. Yeah. That much. Well, you know, Elena, stuff like that, running around, you know. So hopefully they make it more interesting. You feel? Yeah. So we got we got Ham ha- Ham's Law. He's a three mana three three. He used to be a two mana zero two. Ooh. They also very bumped in twice from from bronze to gold. So fan fear, if an enemy card is in play, change this follower's attack and defense X and Y. X and Y are equal to the attack and defense of random enemy follower. Uh-huh. Oh, wait. <laughs> wait a sec. This could be actually good. Good in what? I don't know. Against Dragon? You get like a 2020? You also get a 2020? <sighs> but definitely not good early game. Yeah. Because early game, they're going to have like a 1 2, like, a, a, you know, a 2 2, and then we chance from a 3 yeah. 3 2. Yeah, this guy's like a meme card, you know? <laughs> yeah, yeah, this guy, yeah, it's just a meme yeah. card. Yeah. Shadow is just flexing, you know. Yeah, Alright, next we got... Ooh, the Forest Legendary. Three mana, three, three. Uh, no regular effect. Yeah, no regular effects. It's just a vanilla card. But then the Evil effect is give your leader the following effect during your turn whenever a follow- follower is added to your hand from anywhere but your deck. Huh? Give that follower plus one, plus one. Oh. So you can't search cards from your deck. Dude, that won't give it the stats. Whenever a follower is added to your hand. So the fairies that you add to your hand... So it has to be from effect. Yeah, so the fairies that you get gets yeah. plus one, plus one. The wisp, wisp that you get gets plus one. That, the wisp don't matter. Yeah. Wisp don't really matter. It's just fairies and j- droids that I think that could get added to your hand. Ooh. This is like an aggro card. Is it good? Yeah, it's pretty good. <laughs> it's pretty good. Okay. It might make Forest good again. You mean, I mean, you're playing a one mana two two. That's that's really good. Yeah. Yeah, this card is good. Oh, okay. Might here Forest might be good again. You know, you never know. <laughs> um, next we got Honored Front Guard General. So this guy is reprinted as well. What was he before? Just Front Guard General. Oh. But he was golden, so it's fine. So he's Ward. Cannot be targeted by enemies, Ooh. spells, and effects. That's pretty better than the other one. Um, last word, summon a s- shield a guardian. And give it X plus X. X equals a number of times. Whoa. Wait. Shield guardian is a 1-2 one, ward. Two. Yeah. No, no, it's a 1-1 one, one ward. I think it's a 1-1 one, one oh, ward. Yeah, 1-1 yeah, one, one ward. That guy could be possibly a 6-6. Six, six. <laughs> Yeah, this card is good. Front card in general is good. Yeah, this one's really good. I mean, you can't get targeted. That's already good enough. And then you get a, like a huge as 1-1 one, one after. Yeah, that's good. Good card, good card. Definitely playable. So now we got Golem Squad. If this card been spell boosted 5 or 5 times or less, summon a clay golem or a sc- and a scrap golem. And a scrap golem. If this card been spell boost 6 to, six 11, to 11 times, summon a Guardian Golem and a Clay Golem. Uh, if this has been six. spell boosted 12 times, summon an Ultimate Clay Golem oh. and a Guardian Golem. So let's. So there's Ultimate Clay Golem. He's a token. This is new, right? Yeah, this is new. 7 mana 5 5. This follower can evolve for a 0 evolution oh. points. So basically, you, it's a 7 mana 7 7. I will give you a leader the following effect whenever an ally Clay Golem comes into play, transform into an Ultimate Clay Golem. Ooh. Like this effect is really good, but spell boosting twelve times is a little bit hard. <laughs> but that's the only one you want. Yeah, that's the only one you want. Yeah. Spell boosting twelve times is difficult. Riles. Riles. Yeah. And then you have to draw this card. Ooh. So you play Riles on seven, right? Uh huh. Let's say that you miraculously draw it on uh, 8. This card on 8, alright? Okay. Then you gotta spell boost it another 3 times. And then play it. I mean, that's good if you draw it, miraculously draw it on 8. But if you don't, it's gonna be a very hard card to play. I'm a Seal of Solomon. Seal of Solomon just asks this card for 3. I mean, I mean Seal of Solomon doesn't do anything to this card. Yeah. Yeah. 
So what I'm thinking, right? Mm-hmm. Is you play like Machina. <coughs> Machina like ruined with this card. I don't know. Huh? Because <coughs> Machina Ruin plays Delta Cannon oh, and yeah. Repair Mode so often, you could probably get 12 off. But I'm, I don't see how they're gonna play Clay Golems. Is either in the Earthright deck that you're gonna play this? But I don't know how Earthright's gonna spell boost 12 times. Yeah, what the? I mean, this is a lot. Yeah, Ultimate Clay Golem is definitely a good card. Yeah. This card is definitely good. But we gotta see <laughs> if it's actually good. If this spell card is actually good. Alright, next we got Ayla. A. Reprinted. And the legendary now. So Fanfare hey. gained an empty play point and recovered three play points. So it's a three oh. mana four four. Got a play point. But you're gonna play on turn six. Um Evo, if you have at least six play points, use six play points and summon devoted dragon. Reduce damage of this card to zero while a, a allied devoted dragon is in play. What? So that means on turn nine, you play this, right? Uh -huh. And then you use six mana, she gives you play points, so you have ten uh -huh. mana. And then she recovers three, so you have six more play points. Mm -hmm. And then you evo her, you summon Devoted Dragon, which is a six mana, six, six. Gain Bane War while Ayla is in play. So nine mana, 12, 12. This card is busted. <laughs> nine mana, 12, 12. Bane War and cannot be damaged. Oh, wait. Holy shit. Like, it can't be damaged. So on the first turn you evo it, you get a free trade. And then they gotta kill a 6-6 six, six Bane. Ward. And then they gotta kill your other 6-6. Six, six. Yeah, this is very... This is something else. <laughs> Dragon might be very good down the line. Would you ever just want a gram put there? Yeah, you do. I mean, you got six copies. Because the I'm old Aelo, the problem was that drawing her late game. The old Aelo is like, when you draw her late game, right, at 10 mana, yeah. like... You ain't gonna do jack with her, alright? <laughs> You're not gonna evo her at 10 mana for you because you already have max play points. So if you have multiple in your hand, you you would play this 10 6. Yeah, you just play it. Okay. Cause the old yeah, you know the old one just gives you an empty play point. Yeah. Yeah, but what are you gonna if you draw this on on turn ten is a dead is a is a dead draw. You know what I mean? Yeah. So now it's not that much of a dead draw when you draw it later on. It's definitely really good. I'm not sure you're gonna evo a turn like 9 play point Evo is kind of late, but yeah, that's what I'm saying. it's a good card. It's a good card. Cute. Next, we got Spawn of Exile. Accelerate 2, Summon Voice of Abyss. Voice of Abyss is a 2 mana 1 2. Ambush, yeah. Strike, plus 1 until the end of the turn. Um, Ambush, if this card is activated for you. Uh, if, ambush, if, ac if Ambush is activated for you, just follow her. Three. When it attacks, summons 3. Ambush. Four. Yeah, yeah. Evolve equals 4. It's like Spawn of the Abyss. But now it's Spawn of the Exile. Is it good? Nah. Nah. But an Accelerate 2 actually might be really good. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. The Accelerate 2 is nuts. You get a 2. Man, I want 2. Oh, no, no. You get 1. You don't get 2. Yeah, my bad. You get 1. You get one. <laughs> if it was 2, it would have been nuts. Yeah. yeah, this guy's like a meme card. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's all for the cards that got translated, and they got, yeah, to English. So now we're going on to the untranslated cards. So Brave Elf May. What the? Um, this is uh, Elf. Uh, this Elf May reprinted, I think, because the old Elf May was a one mana one one bronze card, deal one damage. Mm. This one's a one one oh, yeah. one one um golden card. Invocation, okay. During your turn when playing a card, if it's the fourth card played this turn, put this card from your deck into play. Then return it to your hand. Fanfare, deal four damage to enemy follower, but at least four. Ooh. Wait, let me think. Oh, wait, wait, wait. So this is a. I, I get how it works now. Uh huh. So, you play four cards, right? Yeah. This comes out from the deck. Uh -huh. And into play. And the, so now you play five cards. Now you played five cards. 
Oh, well, the fanfare doesn't activate. Fanfare does not activate. So, if, yeah. and, and then it returns back to your hand on that turn. And then you can use Then it. you play it. Yeah. So, you need five mana. And it deals four, I mean, to random enemy follower. That's actually... Is weaker than the old one for sure, but four mm -hmm. damage is a lot. I don't know. Too bad it's a random enemy. Yeah, yeah it's, imagine just his face. <laughs> yeah, this card, not sure it's that good. Yeah, four playing four cards on one turn is a lot for fairy yeah. for forest. But maybe with that new new legendary, you know, this card might be really good. Oh. Okay, so now we got the sword legendary. It's an amulet. What the fuck? So the the thing with sword amulets are is that they're they're never good. <laughs> they're, they're never good. They're never once good. They'll never be good. All right. They're just memes. The legendary. But this guy's a legendary. This is something else. Yeah. Uh, Zero mana play point. Okay, cool. Zero mana. Story for your time turn or later. At the end of a turn, summon a steel clad knight. Knight. That's a 2 2. Uh, Fan for your randomly summon a follow that costs X play point from your deck into play. Spend X play points X equal to remaining. Wait. 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 You can play this like. Turn. You play this whenever you want. <laughs> you play this whenever you want. Turn eight, you get a dom. Yeah, but the dom effect doesn't trigger. Oh, true. Then there, who do you want? Front guard general. Oh. But the temp turn effect is kind of. Okay. <laughs> okay, buddy. I don't think it's that bad. I mean, it's pretty much just search. I just search a card from yeah. the deck and play it, you know? Uh, it probably is going to be a staple card, though. Like, yeah. But a 10th turn... I mean, uh, it's probably because Ladom might get rotated soon, so they go like, oh, let's add another Ladom in there, you know? But more balanced. It's interesting. It's interesting. It's interesting. Uh, next we got... Um, let me see. Ian. Dragon Buster. Four mana... 3-3. Fanfare transform this forward to, to Ian and a Ada? Adele. Adele. Whatever. Alright. Or, or summon Jealous Dragon. Wait, what? Oh, so you get the the newly oh, newly right. weds or whatever or the Jealous Dragon. Fan oh Elf will deal the damage to enemy follower. That's pretty good. Wait, Fanfare choose Oh the the cards are on the scroll down. Yeah, I know I know, but it says Fanfare transform this card into Ian. But why does it have another Evo effect? Or summon... What? Okay, hey. uh, the other one is last word due to damage to all allies. All allies? Ally. This, is jealous, this is Jealous Dragon. Yeah. Wait, what? Oh. To all allies? Is this translated wrong? The other one is return all ally followers to your hand. Huh? Word dream. Wait, if the fanfare is that, how can you have the Evo? Unless it's like, like a, you know, enhanced fanfare. Yeah. Fanfare, choose, transform. What? So what I'm thinking is that it has overflow. <laughs> uh, if it's overflow, you transform to these dudes, and you don't have overflow, you, you, you get the 3-3. Three, three. I don't know, this, this card's not kind of shit. <laughs> yeah, dude, you really do. Yeah, next, next, next card. Uh, Sora, 2 mana 2-2 two, two shadow card. Wait, there's no shadow legendaries I saw yet. Uh, Maybe it's down there. Alright, Fanfare, Necromancy 4, game plus 2 plus 2. I will do X to enemy follower. Ooh. 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 That's card good. <laughs> Definitely good in mid range. Yeah, this card is good. Yeah, it's straight up good. You might get a four mana six, uh, two mana six six, yeah. deal six. Last word. That's good. Um, next we got a Haven card. Um, two mana one four. At the end of the turn, destroy all. Follow. What? 
Uh, no, at the end of your opponent's turn, they share all followers. Yeah. Evil, gain average, I don't know. Uh, <laughs> oh, that's a decree for two mana. Huh. Uh, Wait, I definitely gotta start playing Havencraft now. <laughs> Jessica card kinda nutty. What the? She's kinda cute too. She looks like Snow White. Alright, this card is pretty decent. Next we got another six mana card. Six mana four no six mana oh what's it called? Another golden card. Six mana four four bloodcraft follower. Recover two hour point what, what the, the... <laughs> Huh? Huh? Wait. Wait. <laughs> Wait. 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 Am I looking at this correctly? It's just straight up recover two hour points. Do I gotta start playing Vengeance Blood again? Or this card is Nuts. Yeah. I think I need to play Blood again. Takeda's card. I mean, definitely you don't need fucking what's that card. You're not gonna play Heart Sick Demon on six, all right? You're gonna play this I card. Mention that card again. <laughs> <laughs> all right, that's pretty good. Uh, now we got the Seven Man of Five Five Portal Legendary. Oh, that looks like Orcus. Is Orcus reprinted? Fan for summon Lord or Manos. Nice, okay. Yeah. Whenever Lord comes in play, give it plus two, plus two. Whenever uh um okay comes. Wait, what? Just the old version? Whenever the, uh, a mono uno comes into play, summon another. Summon a duo. Yeah. Oh. Transform up into your hand. Into Tret. Yeah, the, the, the big boy. Oh. Wait, isn't this the same effect? This is a little bit more versatile. So the old one, did the one was so shitty about it? Uh, summon the Lloyd was garbage. Back then, Summon the Lloyd only heals you for three. Uh -huh. But this one, Summon Lloyd gives Lloyd's extra stats. And if you evolve her, right? Because the old one, you didn't want to evolve her. The old one, you just want to, like, the old one, you just play the storm cards and evil the storm cards face. Yeah. This one, you could evil her, get a tre tree, right? The third one. So you can have a Lloyd, a th like a 3-6 Warbane Lloyd, right? Uh -huh. And you can have the 3-3 three, three Storm. I mean, the, the guy that attacks three times. You know uh -huh. what I mean? So this one is like indirectly buffing the Lloyd side. Because back then, Lloyd was pretty shit. You only summon Lloyd when you're, when you're like at 3 HP or something. Because the, uh, the, most of the time, the old one, you just play for Storm. Just Storm face, Storm face, Storm face. But the old one didn't have the... the the marionette. Yeah. It did. I did. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But then it's just that you were never able to summon him. Cause you need two. You need the Uno and Duo to to, to survive until the end of your opponent's turn, to become the tree. Uh, yeah, this one is actually pretty good. Yeah, pretty good card. Pretty good card. I like it. Um, I think we're missing the Shadow Legendary. Yep. So Shadow Legendary has yet to be confirmed. Oh. Um But let me try, let me try and you know digging it up. Wait actually we gotta say which one th which deck we think we is the best. Oh yeah. I forgot about that. Alright Jeffrey. What you think what what you think the the best deck gonna be? Dragon. Dragon? Uh, I don't know. I don't know, Dragon Dragon might be really OP. You know, I don't really like the Ian Dragon bus. Yeah, uh, I mean that card. You're not gonna play it. whoever, whoever cares. Dragon, you know, you're, you know, you know how you play dragons. Wallet dragon, just play the legendaries, all right. Yeah. I really want to play Ultimate Clay Golem. Yeah. I want that. I feel like Sword might be like a, you know, you know, might might be just like a hidden OP. What the Forest thing? might be a hidden OP. Yeah, uh, blood. Blood, you never know. Yeah. The legendary is shit, but the golden cards are good. Yeah, I just realized there's no Haven legendary. Oh, yeah. The... Oh, it's not revealed yet. Yeah. So we're just missing two cards. Um, It's just the Haven and the Shadow. But, you know. Haven, Shadow. They might be good, they might be shit. So, you know. <laughs> Did we see the sword legendary? Yeah, the, the fucking amulet. Oh, God. Yeah, Evil Sword might be really good, though. Yeah. Wait, this guy only adds. 
Wait, no, it's a random follower. It huh? could be it, it could be a neutral follower. You know what I mean? Picardus. Yeah, Picardus Fentry. Alright, yeah, yeah, this card is pretty cool. Alright, that's it. Oh. Uh, Alright, I uh, hope you guys enjoy and I'll catch you guys next time.